Hey guys, it's Jordan. I am going to talk to you today about my coming out story because yesterday, even though I'm late, was National Coming Out Day. I just thought I'd share mine because that's usually what every person does. Well, gay person, I guess you could say. My coming out story is not a long story. Once I realized I was gay, I started hanging out with gay people and stuff. And my dad knew that I was hanging out with gay people, but... I didn't necessarily say, you know, I'm gay, but it was obvious. I mean, I acted gay and stuff. And he was like, why do you want to hang out with gay people if you are straight? People are going to think you're gay. And I was like, I don't care what people think, Dad. But that was just how I was as a person. Anyways, like when I was younger, I just did what I wanted. So, carried over. I dated a boy and then another boy and then... Uh, you know, it led to me wanting to put pictures on Facebook of us, so I did. And my cousin was my friend on Facebook, like two of my cousins. Most of my family was blocked for that reason. Um, but then my cousin, I guess, showed her mom, or her mom saw somehow. And that went on to her showing my grandma, which then burst into the whole family knowing. And it spread, and my grandma called me while I was at our state fair. And she was like, do you have something you need to tell me? And I was like, I don't think so. And she was like, are you sure? And I was like, I'm pretty sure. And then she was like, you know what you're doing, and you need to get those pictures off there. And I was like, well, I'm not by a computer, Grandma, so I can't. She was like, I talked to your dad, and he doesn't know what to think. So immediately I got off the phone. I called my mom. I was just scared because she knew, and nobody else did. But at that point... Um, I was outed, I guess you could say. I was nervous and anxious because it, it's scary. You don't know how people are going to take it, but I didn't necessarily do anything to hide it because it was me. I was like, I'm not going to act like anything but me. Once my dad found out, he didn't really say much to me at first, but then he went on and we went and had dinner a few days after he found out and he just told me how he felt about it and, you know, he told me that he accepted me and at first it was not easy thing to deal with. My parents didn't exactly like it. Um, they didn't really want people over that were gay and stuff like that. And it wasn't simple. I had to fight for what I wanted because I was like, you know, this is me and I can't help it. I want you to accept me because it's not like I intentionally meant for this to happen. It's just who I am. Yesterday, I just spent the day like really being thankful for what I have because my dad now is like the best about it. He lets anyone come over. He accepts me. Sometimes I'll even be like picking out outfits and I'll be like, Dad, does this look right? Do these shoes look right? And he'll be like, yeah, that looks right. That doesn't look right. He doesn't look at, like we do things that a father and son usually might not do, but he accepts it for what it is. I'm really, really thankful because like a lot of people, you know, they have to deal with parents who aren't open about it and who like disown them. And a lot of times I take for my dad like for granted because I think like this is just normal and really my dad is um, he's just a really really good dad and I'm thankful to have him because he loves me for me and he lets me be who I want to be and he doesn't try to stop me no matter if I wear my hair crazy if I wear it down if I'm you know what I'm saying like if when I was straight when I'm gay like he still loves me supports me and pushes me to be the best person I can be and like that's the best dad ever. That's my coming out story. It's hard to get all sappy but it's just so true. Like I love my dad because he is he knows like, you know, no matter what's going on with your kid, you're supposed to love them. That's your job and he does that greatly. If you guys have any of your stories to share or anything like that, um, go ahead and thank you for watching and you know, I just feel like if you feel like you're ready to come out, then do it. But make sure that you feel that you have the support that you need to do it because it is a hard thing to do. Hey guys, thank you for watching. You can follow me on Instagram, at the Jordan Gibson, on Twitter, Jordan Gibson, Facebook, Tumblr. There's a lot of stuff down there. Just follow me and subscribe to me. And I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. Mwah.